and use case diagrams activity and activity diagrams okay a use case is descriptions of a set of sequences actions including variants that a system performs l and observable result of value to an actor in graphical representation use case is a rendered as a an ellipse symbol the how to representation names in the use cases every use case must have name that name uh, and other use cases name is the text textual string that name alone is known as simple name a path name is the use case as name prefixed by the same of the package in which that use case live a use case is typically drawn shown only its name simple name uh, valid user place of order sensors and etc these are the path name sign particular use case ellipse symbol and other any ellipse representation with assigned to the name that is the simple name and path name simple and path name a use case and actor an actor represents a set of rules that users of a cases place when integrating with these cases actor represents a role that a human and hardware device or another system plays within a system actor representation uh, for example automatic teller machine user also actor representation and bank server is also actor representation actor symbol ka representation is stick diagram this is the actor uh, stick diagram example customer and commercial customers etc other any uh, user side either server side etc these are the using for actor symbol a use case diagram is a drawn that shows a set of use cases actor and their relationship is called the use case diagram use case diagram commonly contain use cases actors dependency generalization and association relationship also using like all other diagrams use cases diagrams may contain no sign constraints use case diagrams may also contain packages uh, we want to place instance of use cases in your diagrams as well as especially when you want to visualize a specific execution system common users common users in a use cases we apply use cases diagram to model the static use case view of a system the view primarily support to the behavior of a system or any use case you can identify the, the particular behavior of the system when you model that static use case view of a system and this use case diagram in the one of the two ways to model the context of your system to model the requirement of a system modeling the context of a system first one involve the drawing a line around the whole the system and ascertaining which actor lie outside the system and interact with it modeling the requirements of a system involve specifying that what that system should be sh sorry should do, should do view of all side the system independent of how to that system should do it here you apply use case diagram to specify the derivable behavior of the system example 
example of a use case diagram this is a use case diagram for library management system this is a procedure for a uh, small uh, example for these are the library management system uh, these are the actor representation user and these are the library representation and this is also two different categories of users one is the old user and new user or, or, or student and staff interact with the library first request for book check the available tea check the availability of the books and etc these are the interactions with the student and librarian this is the example of a diagram for use case next use case diagram for automatical teller machine you can uh, first of all uh, this is the semi diagram i shall explain in detail uh, first customer insert the debit card bank server always verification uh, though the card is valid or invalid next valid card then go to transaction continue enter pin number then verify pin number server is the verify the pin number the valid pin number continue to transaction invalid pin number then exit operation then valid pin number check balances deposit funds withdrawal cash transfer funds maintenance and as for example as any technical issues then automatically automatically technician these are the set of sequences and the relationships and actor is called the automatic teller machine next activity diagrams an activity diagram shows the flow of from activity to activity and is on going non automatic execution within a state machine activity ultimately result in the sum action which is made of executable automatic computations that results in a change in state of the system or the return of a value next what are the contents activity diagram commonly contains activity states and activity action states and transitions objects link all other diagrams activity diagrams may contain nodes and constraints these are the contents action state and activity state first to we'll discuss with the uh, action state executable non executable automatic computations are called action state because they are they are stars of the system each representing the execution of an action we representation act state using losing shape action state can't be decomposed further more action states are automatic automatic next activity state can a activity state can be further decomposed their activity being represented by other activity diagrams further more activity states are non automatic meaning that they may be interrupted and in general are considerable to take some duration to complete an action state is activity to state that cannot be further decomposed we can think of activity state composite who flow of control made up to other activity state and action states branching in a flow chart you can include a branch which is specify the alternate paths take based on the some boolean expressions it's like a addition type okay now either positive other two or false we represent a branch is a diamond type shape a branch may have one incoming transaction and two or more than one outgoing 
once on which outgoing transition you can place boolean expression which is avoided by once on entering the branch example release work order material not ready reschedule material ready ready to construction assign task this is the the symbol ka representation for branch next forking and joining when we are modeling works of business process we might encounter flaws of that flaws that are concurrent in the uml you you see a synchronization but to specify the forking and joining of this parallel flow of control a synchronization board is rendered as a think horizontal or vertical line join a join represents the synchronization of two or more concurrent flows of a control a join may be how two or more incoming transition sign one or going transition is called the join these are the symbolical representation for activity diagram sorry activity diagram for automatical teller machine the start symbol representation insert card enter password uh, verification valid password to continue to transaction invalid password to re enter password Select a type of transaction. Performance of the transaction. Invalid transaction go to. I can select the transaction. Can if valid transaction continue to transaction. Transaction successful. Take the card and stop. Next activity diagram for library management system. Student request for books. check for the availability of the books if valid student continue to transaction invalid student stop the transaction valid were the student then go to registration first time student registration already existing student continue to transaction these are the simple procedure for activity diagram for library management system they continue to transaction a uh, book available for the books and available for the student quota then book issue and update the results and a uh, book add the book and etc uh, add the book and enter the details etc and update the details and stuff these are the activity diagram for library management system